Alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Passport to Taiwan at Union Square. This is our 10th year celebrating the Taiwanese American Heritage Week. And since 2002, we have been here celebrating this wonderful event for us, the Taiwanese American, and for you, the New Yorkers. Today I'm emceeing the Passport to Taiwan Festival with co-host Andy Shaw, good friend of mine. I met Alice in Taiwan last year actually. Today's really important to me because it lets all the people in New York who have grown up here but maybe have Taiwanese heritage know that their heritage is very important. Uh, not only that, they have a lot of history, have a lot of culture, that is uniquely Taiwanese, and, and I really like to represent that. Let me introduce myself real quick. I am authentic Taiwanese American. I'm from Taiwan. People here are for the same reason that I'm here. I think people are here for the love of Taiwan. They want to check out Taiwanese culture. So I think that this is uh, going to be a really good opportunity for people to come see what this country is about. You know, the lovely little island. What's the name has for me? Well, it's like an entrance, and not necessarily meaning reflecting the document. But here, yeah, just to get a little taste of what Taiwan is and what Taiwanese American are. What brings people here? The food, for sure. <laughs> Everyone loves Taiwanese food. Well, honestly, it's definitely the food. Uh, definitely the food. Yeah, I want to eat the guapo, uh, la baza. This is a new street food stall in New York City that features Taiwanese food. And uh, over here, this is baza. Baza is uh, another very important food. Uh, this is all wrapped around, it's very easy to carry. And most importantly, is uh, very uh, soon it will be Dragon Ball Festival, so this is what we'll be eating this a lot. But people eat that any time of the year, too. We call that the Formosa Ragu. It's very, very simple with white rice, with minced pork meat, uh, with uh, those uh, yellow cucumbers. And now we have this Oden, this is fish sticks. Made up from, um, actually most of the time, is by shark fish paste. But even though a lot of people like shark fins, but shark meat are actually useless. They are not quality food. So they just grind them and then make it into like a, like a long shape kind of thing. Hey, we, we gave it a very interesting name called Jack of the Popsicle. In Taiwan, when they slaughter the pigs or the chicken, they like to drain their blood so that the meat is more tender. They dip around in peanut, in a peanut uh, crush, uh, peanut powder, and then uh, they put cilantro over it. Jay bags, this is one of our long time, long time favorite. You know, with the crushed rice, and then uh, what we have is um, these uh, red beans, they are cooked for hours, and uh, along with condensed milk, and then we also have the mango flavor. You can, you can always see the line is never, you know, short. It's only short when this is done. This is, uh, we call it ice cream wrap, and we wrap it with ice cream, with cilantro, and crushed peanut butter. How does these three act? It's very weird. People, people think this is such a weird combination, but it tastes really good. This is gua bao, which we translated just into a Taiwanese burger. The meat is pork, and it has to have the fatty part. It tastes really good. Yeah.
favorite thing about uh, the festival? Oh, the craft stalls. I like the craft stalls. Every year there's different craft stalls, so sometimes you get calligraphy. That's almost a staple. Sometimes you get lion dancing. I think that's one reason I come back, because the craft stalls are always different. And I like crafts. And I wonder what you do. Are you somewhere Or is someone loving you? Tell me how to win your I'm here to see Notorious MSG. They're definitely famous and a hilarious band. tell someone to come check out one thing, it would probably just be an overall abundance of tasty Taiwanese food. I love the, the craft, I love the food, I love the performers, you know, and I, I think most of it I just want people to, to, to come check out the energy of the love we have for Taiwan. This 